In today's video, we're gonna create this logo animation in After Effects where you can go and change your logo to whatever logo you like. Go to the main com and it updates here. And you can even use a text like what I'm doing here. Go to the final comp and it is there, right? The download links for this template will be there down below. With that out of the way, let's go ahead and create a new composition and I'll show you exactly how to build this from scratch. All right, so I'll rename this render it. Okay, and you can drag your logo inside this composition. Go and right click pre-compose and you can call this logo move all attributes hit okay all right let's import the texture which is this for the reflection map go to the effects and presets and type in offset drag and drop it on that texture and we're going to animate this shift all right from here set a keyframe go to the last keyframe and move it this way okay so once you're done with that go to the effects and presets and search for tint and i'm gonna tint it and right click pre-compose it and rename this to reflection move all attributes and hit ok set the track mat of this reflection to alpha mat all right so go to the effects and presets and search for cc glass drag and drop it on the reflection here collapse the surface and bump map to logo and softness to maybe 50 and height to maybe around 40. go to the effects and presets and search for ccbl and go and select this drag and drop it on the reflection map and collapse this and select this blob layer to logo and maybe softness to around five so we're almost done there let's go and create a new solid for the background bg for background move this layer below everything and go and search for ramp gradient ramp on that solid and change this to black and the start color to a little bit lighter than the previous one and you can select this from linear to radial ramp and maybe even brighten it up and i'm going to animate this start ramp set a keyframe at the beginning of the timeline go to the end of the timeline and move this somewhere here and ramp scatter to maybe around 100 all right once you have that select the reflection and the logo right click and pre-compose it once again and you can rename this to final logo all right hit okay go to the effects and presets and search for drop shadow drag and drop it on that final logo and increase this opacity and distance and maybe even soften the shadows i'm going to set a keyframe for this direction at the beginning of the timeline set a keyframe go to the last keyframe and i'm going to shift this something somewhere here and maybe even go and lighter lighten the backgrounds a little bit the last and final thing that i added was to to add a glow go to the effects and presets and type in glow drag and drop it on that final logo and you can increase the glow something like this so that is how you create this logo animation i hope you like this video thanks a lot for watching and i will see you in my next video take care